quick drop a like and subscribe in the next six seconds if you want to unlock the deadpool skin in fortnite and here on the channel i gift five subscribers every single day so if you want the season two battle pass or the new skins from the item shop like the slurp legends pack or some of the new cosmetics simply subscribe to the channel with notifications turned on and let me know what's your epic name in the comment section so i can go ahead and add you and also i'm an epic partner so use code garu in the fortnite item shop as it directly supports the channel and on top of that it allows me to do all the daily giveaways here on the channel possible so thanks to everyone who uses code garu in the item shop yo what's going on guys my name is garu and welcome back to the channel and on today's video i got a lot of new leaks infos and a full challenges guide for the week 6 deadpool challenges in fortnite and on top of that i will also show you guys the week 6 reward for the deadpool challenges so if you want to complete your deadpool challenges and unlock the deadpool skin then we are at the right place and we are getting super close to 1.9 million subscribers so if you hit the subscribe button right now you will help us reach this amazing milestone so basically if you guys don't know for the week 6 deadpool update there has been a lot of changes happening in the map and all of them are caused by deadpool i'm pretty sure you guys have seen a lot of posters to join the ghost or the shadow team well it looks like deadpool is now going all over the map and is doing a lot of stuff here and there which is kind of funny if you guys don't know, the posters that you guys have seen originally, they're being changed by Deadpool. For the week 6 Deadpool challenges, we actually gotta go ahead and deface these recruitment posters. Well, you guys know what they actually look like, but Deadpool is just going around and messing with them. So for the week 6 challenges, we actually gotta go ahead and deface them. But because of Deadpool, there has been a lot of changes happening in the map. So basically, wherever you guys will see these posters, they will be updated into this. So that's gonna be pretty cool and I'm super excited to see what this is gonna be because as the season progresses we'll see more changes happening at this place and a lot of things are gonna move here and there. So right now I'm gonna show you guys the week 6 Deadpool challenges and the rewards in Fortnite. I will also show you guys how you guys can complete them because the reward is absolutely insane. So on the screen right now, you guys can see that these are gonna be the week 6 Deadpool challenges in Fortnite, which will give us a free reward. The first challenge for the week 6 Deadpool challenges is gonna be find Deadpool's big black marker. And the second challenge is gonna be deface ghost or shadow recruitment posters. I will show you guys all the locations on today's video. So when the challenges come out, you can be the first one out there to unlock the Deadpool rewards and unlock the Deadpool skin before your friends does. Okay, so right now, first of all, I'm gonna show you guys four locations for the Shadow posters here in Fortnite. So the first two locations are gonna be located at Frenzy Farm. And if you guys are following this video, then when the week six challenges are coming out, you don't have to look for any videos and you can just watch this video and complete your Fortnite challenges. It's going to be pretty simple. I'll also show you guys the locations for the ghost posters. But as you guys can see over here, that this is going to be our first location for the shadow poster. As of right now, this hasn't been updated. On the screen right now, you guys can see that the poster is going to look something similar to this one when you guys interact with this poster. Now, don't leave the game yet because if you keep on walking, through this farm there's gonna be another shadow poster that we can go ahead and visit and the reason why i'm showing you guys these locations is because there's gonna be a lot of people who will try to come over here and complete the challenge so if they go ahead and destroy this place just like this for example you can't complete the challenge so if you don't see it or if someone has interacted with that don't worry about a thing because the next location is super close to this one so right now if you guys are in a team rumble game you guys can easily make a ramp but basically this is gonna be the main house at frenzy farm and literally on the left side of this house there's gonna be our next poster for the shadow team so i'm pretty sure you gotta go ahead and track with this so this is gonna be the minimap location as well where you guys can find this and the other location was on this side in the minimap so you guys can go at any one of these places and complete your challenge right now i'm gonna show you guys two extra locations for the shadow posters and then i'm gonna show you guys four locations for the ghost posters here in fortnite so if your battle bus is on top of holly hedges and not on top of frenzy farm then just drop in at holly hedges because this is gonna be our next location for the shadow posters here in fortnite so you guys know that this is gonna be the main house 
at Holly Hedges. And literally on this side, as you guys can see, next to the trash can, there's going to be a shadow poster. So if you guys can just come down over here and complete your challenge, this is going to be the minimap location where you guys can easily complete the challenge. So this is going to be Holly Hedges. And on this side, on top of the word Holly, just look on top of it and there's going to be this shadow poster. The next location is also going to be super close to it. So we are going to go over there and complete our challenge. So I want you guys to go at the south direction of the map. And at the right side, you guys will see this small little storage kind of unit. And literally over here, there's going to be our next location for the shadow poster. So you guys can also go ahead and pick this one up. You guys can go at any one of them. But if I were you, I would go ahead and collect this one. Because a lot of people can actually go ahead and collect that poster. So make sure you guys go ahead and collect this poster to complete the challenge. The next locations that I'm going to show you guys is going to be for the ghost posters. Now this is going to be pretty easy because the next locations are going to be super close to it. Let's go ahead and take this llama and hopefully we get a launch pad from this. Okay, we got a launch pad. So what I'm going to do is... I'm going to go ahead and make a launch pad and we are going to go at Slurpee Swamp because that is going to be our next location for the ghost posters here in Fortnite. And obviously, if you guys are playing Team Rumble, you guys can literally complete this challenge in one game because you guys can drop in at Holly Hedges, collect those two posters and make a ramp and go at Slurpee Swamp. It's that simple. And the posters are going to be super close to this place as well. I'll show you guys. And it takes me a lot of time behind the scenes to find these locations. So it would be really nice if you guys can subscribe to the channel and check out my videos on Fortnite challenges when I post them. But yeah, this is going to be our location for the ghost poster here in Fortnite. As you guys can see over here, we are at Slurpee Swamp. It didn't even take us 30 seconds. And we're at our next location. Now, the poster when you interact with this is going to look something similar to this. I'll pull it up in the screen right now and you guys will see what the poster might even look like. So, these posters are definitely going to change. But this is going to be the minimap location at Slurpee Swamp where you guys can find this place. There's a lot of like outlets for the Slurpee Swamp region. So, if you guys are getting confused, just look at the rig. And literally in between the rig and Slurpee Swamp, there's going to be this cabinet. And next to that, there's going to be this poster for join ghost right now i'm going to show you guys another location for the ghost poster and i'm going to show you guys two more locations for the ghost posters that you guys can find at salty springs and yeah this location is going to be super close to this one because all we got to do is go down these stairs let's see and there we go that is going to be our next location for the ghost poster so go ahead and collect that one as well and this is going to be the minimap location where you guys can find this literally below the letter s look down and that is gonna be our location so yeah okay so right now we are going at salty springs and obviously if you guys don't want to go at slurpee swamp and if the circle is on this side you guys can make the ramp from holly hedges to salty springs and over here we are gonna get ourselves two posters for the shadow team one of them is gonna be inside this gas station like kind of in the outside so this is gonna be a really good location guys because I'm gonna be honest, everyone is fighting on those houses at Salty Springs. So no one is gonna come inside this gas station just to check it out because most of the posters are outside. So you guys can go ahead and interact with this and complete your challenge. For the newcomers out there, this is gonna be the minimap location where you guys can find this. I'm gonna show you guys another location for the ghost poster here at Salty Springs. And you guys know me, I make videos on Fortnite challenges on every Thursdays and Fridays to help you guys out with your Fortnite challenges. So. If you want to complete your Fortnite challenges in the fastest way possible, just subscribe to the channel with notifications turned on. So when these challenges come out, you can be the first one out there to complete your Fortnite challenges or unlock the Deadpool skin. So right now, you guys can see that I'm going near the blue house and literally on the opposite side, which is going to be the front end, we will see the ghost poster. There we go. That is going to be the location where you guys can find this. And this place is going to be a little bit hectic. So yeah, you guys can easily just drop down over here, land on the roof, come down, interact with the poster and complete your challenge. Now the next challenge is going to be find out pool's big black marker and completing this challenge is going to be pretty simple. So as you guys know, the first challenge for every week's Deadpool challenges, all the locations could be found inside Deadpool's headquarters. Like if you have a look at the letter to Epic Games, the milk carton, the toilet plunger, 
the katanas, all this stuff, unicorn. We could find all of those places inside Deadpool's headquarters. So just like that, just go ahead and have a look inside the battle pass headquarters. Basically, wherever the marker is going to be, there's going to be an icon similar to this one on top of it. So finding this is going to be super simple and I'm pretty sure it's either going to be inside the Deadpool's headquarters, minus upgrade ball or inside one of these agent section. You guys can have a look inside the Brutus one and literally on these tables and stuff like that, you guys will find it. You guys can also have a look inside the TNT and his agent. Also have a look inside the agents have for Meowsels because it could even be located over there. I'm 100% sure that this will be located inside the battle pass tab, but make sure you check out on the pinned comment down below because I'll update you guys where you guys can find the Deadpool marker in Fortnite. And once we complete the week six Deadpool challenges, we will get ourselves the brand new Deadpool wrap and this is 100% official and this looks super neat on the screen right now you guys can see what this wrap actually looks like in game and on a scale of 1 to 10 I would definitely give this wrap a 10 out of 10 because this is an exclusive wrap and on top of that if you guys have the Deadpool skin or if you have a skin which has a red and black outfit theme like the Red Knight I think then the wrap is gonna go really well with it so I want you guys to comment down below right now if you guys like the Deadpool rap in Fortnite, on a scale of 1 to 10, let me know in the comment down below. 